Jazz musician Ron Wilkins is known for his talent on the trombone. To avoid the pandemic in New York City, where he lives, Wilkins returned to his hometown of San Antonio. As Jesse DeGriato explains, a close friend believes this is where COVID-19 finally caught up with him. I hope you all are well. I hope you all are healthy. The well-known jazz trombonist from San Antonio based in New York City. Ron Wilkins also talked about a friend of his. He's on the tail end of his dealing with the coronavirus, but it's nasty. It's really nasty and it's deadly. So you want to really be careful. Yet less than two weeks after posting that and taking his own precautions, Wilkins was hospitalized here in San Antonio. Now he's in a rehab facility after 33 days on a ventilator. He's doing amazingly well. He's just been so determined and resilient. Shown here with his donor, Wilkins had a kidney transplant seven years ago, but also given his most recent ordeal. I was just terrified and he managed to do it again just just bounce back and, and come back with his great spirit. Yet she says it's too soon to say whether he'll resume playing his treasured trombone. But the fact that he had such strong developed lungs and is just a master at breathing techniques, I think really saved his life. A jazz trombonist herself. I've just been dreaming about being able to to play together again, and I'm, I'm very hopeful that that will happen. Before Wilkins fell ill, he urged people to get tested and seek medical help. Because this coronavirus is really bad. Jesse Degollado. Y'all take care. Love ya. KSAT 12 News.